life update. Uh, I am still working from home and Adam has taken on a new job and he's working long hours, which means I really need something to kick me into gear, you know, so I'm not just sitting and creating content and writing and looking at my computer screen all day. I kind of need like a kickstart. So, I decided to do something about it. One of the things that I've noticed as, you know, I've been working from home is that I tend to have like a slump in the middle of the day and I feel like I'm losing focus. Also, I feel like I get into these zones where I'm just like staring into my phone or staring into my computer and sometimes I'll get headaches, sometimes I'll get migraines. I was just kind of looking for something that was going to help with that. Also, as you guys know, I am passionate about health and wellness and, you know, just sitting on and working on my computer all day is not beneficial to my body or to my mind. So one of the things that I've been trying to do is work out, which is very on and off. When it's coupled with something, if like when I put working out with like kind of like a challenge, um, I'm able to do it more consistently. So that being said, I'm doing a 10 day challenge and I wanted to let you guys know, I'm gonna be drinking ketones for 10 days. I'm doing the ketone challenge, actually. The 10 day drink ketones challenge. I just got my box, so I'm gonna show it to you. Came in this black box, all right? So what I got was in this 10 day challenge, the ketones are this multi-patented, technology. They're little powders that go in water. If you follow me on Instagram, you know I'm always putting things in my water already as it is because water is boring. I'll be drinking two of these every day. They sent also little directions in the mail too um, with the box and they recommend drinking the first one. So okay, there's two. Do you see how like there's there's two of these and there's two of these and so there's two each day and they're different flavors and one is caffeinated and one is not. Okay, so they recommend drinking the first one when you first wake up to jumpstart your day with energy and focus and then do the second one in the afternoon, so like after lunch. And these little packs, they say that it elevates mental clarity and focus, it increases and sustains energy, it regulates digestion, hormones and metabolism, it boosts your body's natural ketone production. If you're keto, obviously you're gonna know exactly what that is and you're gonna be all about it. For me, I'm not keto, but I'm vegan and these are also vegan friendly. Clearly, I wouldn't be doing it, but doing it if it wasn't and supports fat loss, which that's not my focus, but everything else, yeah, I can definitely benefit from mental clarity and boost of mood and all of that. So the reason why I decided to do the 10 day challenge rather than just like getting some of these packs was one, like I said, I feel like it helps me actually dedicate to something and actually do it every day if it's going to be like a challenge, like, like I want to feel results. And then also with the 10 day challenge, I got this as well. This is their water bottle and it has, as you can hear, a little shaker in there. I actually don't have one of these, so I'm excited to have this now. It's very cute. It's like a matte black with the yellow. The other benefit of using the 10 day challenge or doing the 10 day challenge rather than just like getting the individual packs or anything is because you get free Prove It coaches, which that's the company was Prove It. Um, and you get to be a part of the private Facebook group and the support system, lifestyle hacks, a community accountability and exclusive discounts on products. So accountability is what I'm looking for. If you want to do it, of course, I'll have all the links down below. Otherwise, if you want to just see me try to stick to something for 10 days, stay tuned. Good morning, everyone. Today is my first day on the Drink Ketones Challenge, 10 day challenge. I'm used to drinking um, strawberry like flavored things, so I'm gonna start with the strawberry peach and um, this is the charged one. So that's the morning one, that's what it is. So, gonna try that one out. I'm gonna put some ice in it too because I like my morning water with ice. So I filled up the water like halfway so I could mix it in good. Adam's making smoothies back there as you can tell. It's a Saturday, so we're both home. Gosh, is this a big enough? It smells good. Oh, shoot. I should have used the bottle that they gave me. It's got the little stir thingy in it. I'm gonna pour this in here. I'm excited. I've never had a bottle like this. This is like what all the like fitness people use. It's mm. a lot more water. Mmm. Mmm. Some of my little ice chunks are getting through the filter, which is good. I like it. 
which is good. So this one was the Charged, which has caffeine. Like I said, it's a strawberry peach. I'm excited. Is it gonna give me super focus today? We shall see. So I'm gonna stick to like the same flavor. This afternoon, I'll do this one. This one is the same flavor. It's just without caffeine, I think. I saw one review said that it might make you poop. I think it's just because you're drinking a lot of water. We'll see if I do, if it gives me the poops. <laughs> I'll keep you updated. <laughs> okay, so a couple things. First, the caffeine obviously works because I haven't had a caffeine headache without coffee. I didn't have coffee this morning. I haven't had it at all today. So yeah, the caffeine obviously works and I feel good. I've been focused. I don't know if that's just like because it's Saturday and I have the time to just like do what I need to do. But so far, feeling pretty good. I actually I finished that up and then I filled this up again one more time um, with just like regular water. And now I'm going to do the second one of the day and it's the, um, I mean it's the same flavor. It's the strawberry peach, but it's just the non-caffeinated one. I'm about to go work out. Day one, here we go. Well, good morning everyone. Today is day two of the 10 day challenge. Yesterday I did work out. Some of these have the little thing on it to where it's like easy to pull off and some of them are not easy to pull off. So today I'm going for the lime time one. I have water in there right now. Then I'll just fill it up with ice. This is the caffeinated one because it's morning. Oh, on that, I really didn't need like any coffee yesterday. I got decaf like later on in the evening because I missed coffee, like having a coffee. But honestly, it was a good amount of caffeine. That's gonna be it. I think I'll probably go for a long walk today. We'll see what happens. But Adam's off work, so might work out, might go on a walk. Day two. Yesterday, last night, I ended up drinking a lot with my sister. That being said, I'm pretty sure that these ketones have helped my hangover. Um, I feel like it's just like kept my energy up. I had a video shoot, I needed to go shoot photos for behind the scenes stuff. And I had enough energy, you know, for that client. And I was not dying of a hangover. I did have one but I wasn't dying of one. That's a cool thing. Also, I think I've noticed a little bit of like a flatter stomach. So like bloating maybe, it's helping with that. I think that's a great thing. It could be like a really great aid. So hey, I'm on day three. I just finished up the, the caffeinated flavor or the caffeinated powder for the day. And now I'm drinking a thing of water. I just fill it up. Yeah. I'll show you, remind you what it looks like. I just filled this up with water in between with like no powders in it. After I finish this up, I'll use powder, the uncaffeinated one. It's also making me drink a lot of water. So maybe that's what's helping the bloating. I don't know, but either way, it's helpful. It's nice. I feel like my pants are fitting nicely. So that's great, but yeah. Okay. So, finished the challenge, and I will say, I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed the consistency of, you know, having something to keep me drinking water. I think drinking more water has made it to where I feel better, and I feel like I didn't have as much bloat. I think I had mentioned that. The only thing is, there were days that I was really busy, and I didn't get the chance to fill up just plain water in between the you know, the morning drink and the, e and the evening drink. I will say there were days that I just was tired of a flavor in my water. And so that was some days that were like not as great, but it was really cool to see how much water I could possibly drink in a day. And it's not like that much. I mean, this isn't like that large, but at the same time, you know, when you're busy and you're on the go, it, it's a lot of water. So anyway, I really enjoyed that. Um, I didn't end up doing a lot of working out still. My husband recently started a new job and like I had mentioned, and we have just kind of been figuring out our schedules and didn't really get into a swing of working out again. We did a couple times and I think we went on like a walk or whatever, but we've both just been really busy. So actually having something to at least keep me hydrated and, and be in a healthy mindset about my physical wellness was really nice. It was really helpful. It inspired me to think about how I'm doing physically and therefore it helped me mentally as well. I will say the morning drinks with the, it, they call it charged and it has the caffeine in it, are quite caffeine filling, <laughs> if that makes sense. There were several days that I, you know, I would make coffee every day. My husband would make coffee every day and I wouldn't even finish it. I would hardly drink it at all actually because I just felt awake. So if you're looking for a way to kind of kick coffee, I feel like doing a 10 day challenge is going to help 
you ease into that, which is really cool. I'm sure there'll be a time in my life where I take the challenge of being coffee free. I might go back to drinking ketones. So a couple things at the end of this that I can say is, one, I had a lot more energy, two, I had way less bloat, and three, it kept me thinking about my physical wellness, which helps my, phys my mental wellness, and I really enjoyed the challenge of having specific drinks to do every day. And it got me excited because I could switch up the flavors and so every day was something different and I really enjoyed that aspect of it. If you are looking for a challenge, if you're looking for a way to change things up, I guess I really recommend it because it's not gonna hurt you. It's just going to benefit you. You're getting good vitamins and minerals. I will read a couple things. So you're getting a lot of B12 in, in all of them, okay? So you're getting a lot of B12, a lot of B6 and you're getting a good amount of magnesium, 56% um, of the daily value, and you're getting a good amount of calcium, 18%, which is 230 milligrams. So between magne magnesium, calcium, and vi vitamin B6 and B12, I mean, that's worth it in and of itself. One last note is, you know, on the weekends, I like to drink some, and it was really nice to help with some hangover blues. So that's kind of a random extra element that I feel like the B12 and the magnesium and the B6 probably really helped me with. Of course, I'll link everything down below if you are interested in getting the ketones and doing the ketone drink for 10 days challenge, I will have the link down below and you can get 30% off of your products for the 10 day challenge. I hope you try it out. If you do, let me know. If you like this sort of video, comment down below and let me know what you want to see next. That's gonna be it for now. Until next time, guys, bye.